Good morning, welcome to another video. Today is Valentine's Day and we are in Palmero in Sicily. Palmero is located on the northwest tip of Sicily and it's a sunny day here today. We're going to be spending the morning here in Palmero and then probably spending some time on the ship as well. So just as kind of a disclaimer, I felt ill from this day forward. So the vlogs from now on aren't as good as I thought they would be. I was really, really excited to vlog Palmero in Malta and a day at sea, but honestly, I just felt so ill. It was nothing to do with the ship or anything. It was just a typical cold, but it's really horrible. So these vlogs might not be as good as usual and I do apologize for that, but keep on watching and enjoy. So we just got off the ship and we were literally bombarded by so many people who were trying to sell stuff. It was quite an uncomfortable experience they're coming again now. So yeah, there's people that come up to you and they're trying to like sell you stuff, sell you taxis, sell you horse routes and stuff. We just kind of look at them like, <laughs> you know. But yeah, we're gonna walk around, try and get away from this area. You can see it's a little bit uncomfortable, but so far it's seems pretty nice. I didn't really go into a lot of detail about this because surrounding that area at that time was that a lot of people who were asking for taxi rides and asking for horse rides. It was pretty much like this in all of the ports that we went to, but this was so much worse. There were so many more people. There were so many more kind of situations where they were really coming up to you and pressurizing you in a way. It wasn't very nice at all. As soon as you leave about five minutes from the port area, that does stop. Although compared to other ports, Palmero just felt a little bit more run down, a little bit more, like a little bit more poor. And I think that was one of the situations with the port, which really just felt a bit uncomfortable as tourists in that area, if that makes sense. So current impressions of Palmero, it is very busy. It's a lot of traffic, but it's very pretty. It's very rustic and old, as you guys can see, but it's quite nice. It's very Italian. The Grand Square makes it very posh, very lovely, lots of fountains, lots of nice buildings and it's nice and sunny. And as you can tell, if you walk about 20 minutes away from the actual port, there's this beautiful, rustic, authentic, Italian kind of square area, which is honestly so beautiful. And it just felt proper Italian, proper Sicilian. Is that the word? I don't even know. But I would say though, definitely keep to the main roads. This is somewhere that you wouldn't want to get lost in, if that makes sense. So this is the Cathedral of Palmyra. It's very beautiful. Very Italian. So we're just heading back down to the cruise ship, which is over there, and we are currently at the beautiful little harbour area where um, it's quite busy on the roads but it's a bit more peaceful compared to the city centre which was really really busy And as you can tell, this port area was honestly so nice it had a really nice relaxing feel to it and we were kind of the only people around this area as well which was lovely and I'm so sorry for this super quick ending to this video. I think by then I was honestly just knocked out. I was pretty ill at this point. But anyway, we had gala night that evening, which despite being ill, like I've said about a million times, it was such a lovely night, a really good time to dress up and really it's a good time to be with the whole family and celebrating such an amazing holiday. Overall, we didn't really have much expectations for Palmero, but I would say it's probably our least favorite port simply because of the start of it. And we didn't really spend a lot of time there because there wasn't really that much to do. However, we did really enjoy it. I'd say it's worth getting off and having a little walk around as always. But thank you so much for watching my pretty naff version of a video. And hopefully tomorrow, the letter is a little bit better. Thanks so much for watching.